the current single off Dave Garn's latest album. The frontman of new wave British band Depeche Mode spent four years working on Hourglass. I didn't start out with any kind of theme to like how I was writing lyrics, but there's definitely that wanting to expose myself more and not being so kind of like caught up on like, um, it has to be about something. It's more about um, trying to find out who I am. To many, Dave Garn will always be best known as Depeche Mode's charismatic singer. Since forming in Basildon, near London, in 1980, the band has sold 90 million albums worldwide. Even though guitarist Martin Gore writes the band's songs, Depeche Mode has always been first and foremost Dave Garn. These days, he's a pop icon. Cool, cool guy. I'd trade any man in the world for him. He's great, I love his music. He's amazing. My idol for 23 years. Depeche Mode couldn't exist without him. We've been fans for decades. Depeche Mode are unique. Soundtrack of my life. At Garn's record release party in Berlin, the experts agree that Depeche Mode are still incredibly influential. Depeche Mode has always had a cult following. In some of the songs back in the 1980s, Dave Gahn liked playing the role of the savior. But also, on the other hand, the man suffering for our sins. Depeche Mode is classic synthesizer pop, but like other classics, they've never stayed the same. They don't just appeal to aging rockers and hardcore collectors. They found the secret to staying fresh sounding. been equally successful as a solo artist. I have that desperate feeling and trouble is where I'm going to be. On his second solo album, he proves his songwriting skills once again. It's something I, I read as well recently, something Tom Waits was saying that, you know, uh, which I liked, he said something about you know, when you start out, everything that you do is a little piece of everyone else. He said, you know, you go through all these phases of being this other character. He said, and eventually you've kind of you're left with yourself. And then you can start to feel like you feel your own voice. And I think that's starting to happen for me. No doubt Dave Gunn will also be demonstrating his newfound self-confidence on the new Depeche Mode album set for release next year. The fans can hardly wait.